Hello, I'm Milton Chang of Bonsai Elum. And today I want to show you a very old tree. And in fact, I think, well, this is a historic tree, so let me explain. When they were bulldozing Los Angeles for freeway, probably 80 years ago, some of these nursery men went and picked up the trees they bulldozed up. And in this case, it's a pomegranate tree. And I suspect it's a wonderful variety because I've gotten red pomegranate about this size from it uh, in the past. Although it's not every year I can get any fruits because this tree needs to be constant watering, I think. And in a bonsai pot, it's a little bit uh, challenging, but you can. I, in fact, I hope this year I'll get fruits because it's a lot of rain. And so what happened is that uh, they treasure these old trees, not so much for its beauty, but the fact they are old. So it was in a tub about this size and the trunk was about this big. You can see how big the trunk was. And so this tree could be a hundred years old, right? Because some old houses, the early immigrants planted the pomegranate their fruits in the yard and that's a tree. So it was a round tree about this tall in a tub. And the old man would never sell it, neither would the son. But when the old man died and one of the main branch died off. Uh, the young man couldn't stand it. And so he was willing to sell it to me in a tub about this tall again. It's a round, perfectly round tree, just tapered. And I looked at it for probably a good eight to 10 years, didn't know what to do with it because what do, I, what do you do with a big tree round like that? So I saw what you may call the line, which is uh, this curve on this big trunk, this round tree. And this is part of the tree. I didn't contrive this. So I took a chainsaw and cut off the rest of it. And this part was no more than this size. Okay, so this is about 15 years ago. And I bought a tree maybe 20, uh, 20 years ago. So that, that's a net result of this tree. And all the leaves will come out. And again, I will show you in May, uh, in May how the tree will look like. It will be just growing full of leaves and I had to clip it to make it grow. And actually I wouldn't shape it too close because for pomegranate, the, the, the pomegranate tend to grow out at the long end of the uh, long branch. So it will look very bad for a while. And then when winter, it's sort of like fall comes when you want to show the bonsai, you cut off the excess branch and save the long branch for the hanging fruit. And that will be People would just appreciate us seeing, people, people get very excited when they see a little tree with big fruits. So uh, this is one, one of my pride and joy. And I'd like to someday donate it to the museum because it's got truly historic value of the early immigrants that come to California. Thank you for visiting us. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it inspire you to take some old trees and try to do something with it to fit your imagination. I hope you like the video and subscribe to us uh, channel and we'll notify you when we have new posting which I intend to do regularly for example this tree I'll post it in May June time frame so check us out thank you